So here is the two-time World Combat Sambo champion, Khabib Nurmagomedov. He has been dominant every step of the way in his mixed martial arts career. He actually used to wrestle bears as a kid and has been equally successful with human beings. Perfect in his MMA career. We'll see how it goes for him here tonight, Joe, in what is another big spot. This guy has ruthless one-punch knockout power. You can't teach it, but when a fighter has it, it's a huge advantage. Just by nature of Conor McGregor returning to the UFC, tonight is one of the biggest nights in the history of the Ultimate Fighting Championship. Conor McGregor making his return after more than 600 days away. Of course, he dipped his toe into the boxing ring against Floyd Mayweather, but ultimately this is a mixed martial artist, and he is out to prove that he can return to the game the way he left it as the best fighter in the world. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan-favorite combination. the tape for this lightweight scrap. Both fighters 29 years of age. Nurmagomedov is one inch taller. McGregor will have a four inch reach advantage. All right, now to get us started, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. <laughs> record of 27 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Habib the Eagle This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, four losses. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the notorious Connor McGregor! You've been given your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go down right now. We are underway. Oh! Full guard now. 
now. Back to the stand-up now. Both fighters upright. Well, the body was wide open. Oh! This could be it. And now start to step off that track. Oh! And just oh! like that, the fight is over. That's it. Landed a hard kick for the knockout. Indeed, Joe, that was a tremendous kick to end the fight tonight. Caught the opponent flush with full force and extension. And frankly, there was no chance after that. The fight was over as soon as that one made contact. Certainly one for the highlight reel here tonight. Let's look at it from a different angle. Watch this again here. Boom. And there he is after a massive knockout here tonight. Near perfect execution and a seminal moment for him here in the Octagon tonight. Here is Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 1 minute, 32 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, the notorious Colin McGregor! Well, we're getting used to saying it. Conor McGregor, your winner yet again as he continues what has been one of the most remarkable legacies in UFC history. And when the lights are at their brightest, as they were here tonight, the notorious Conor McGregor seems to come through.